Youth with Queen DJ, and in today's video, I will be reacting to Rain to episode 4 of Love Live Nijikasaki School Idol Club. So let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Look at my baby! Second best girl! That's right, baby! Oh my god! I think a lot of people probably maybe as of now, maybe some of my subs know who my best girl is, but, and I really would love to say, I mean, I could give a clue, but if I do, it'll be like hella obvious. <laughs> Baby. Excuse me. <laughs> oh my god, you, you were really short. <laughs> Seriously? Well, you know, YouTube is your answer for all your things that you want to know. <laughs> but I'm guessing what they're going to do is, from the preview of last week, this is an eye focus episode. And maybe because I and Rena are somewhat of a duo from what we've seen from episodes one to now, I'm guessing Rena will be the next focus in episode five and you know what I'm okay with that because she precious baby girl who needs to be protected even though she is not my number one I still love her I love all these freaking girls but my best girl who's number one who I can't say <laughs> when the time comes it's coming I know it is it's just we don't know when So this opening is like, damn, the best fucking opening for this series. Like, oh. Yeah, that you need to practice. Maybe write some songs. Oh, Emma. <laughs> Emma's so precious. Like, oh my god. right no 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 it, it's good that you said that <laughs> of course you do Mm-hmm. 
that's fine. Oh, are we going to split into their, like, subunits? It'd be funny if they did that, but <laughs> I don't think it's going to happen, like, immediately. Nina. Mm. babies. <laughs> no. Good job. Really? So she's like, um, well, we can, she is a gadu, of course, but she's more like, um, what? Yui from Idol Master 10 Roller Girls. I don't mind, um, Yui's more like sporty, upbeat, cute, adorable. My second fave passion girl. Even though I'm just strictly a cool producer. <laughs> of course you did. Kasumi. <laughs> Stamina. Mm hmm. Puffy face, like, mm. if that is not a part of the love live memes, mm. <laughs> no, you did fine. Mm -hmm. I did you make nicknames for everybody? <laughs> What's up? They're so cute. Oh my god. <laughs> this is the start of a very beautiful friendship. <laughs> I 
die early? <laughs> yeah. They're so cute. Oh my god. Please stop. Like, I can't. Oh. Oh, it's cucumbers? Um, pickles. Oh. Hmm? Can someone just take screenshots of their whole freaking school in every single episode, please? Because the angles that they give of this school, I mean, like, I wish I could go to this school. This school's too freaking pretty. Witches. I'm worried about that. Hmm. Of course, it's going to be something that's going to be on Aya's mind for the most of this episode. It's okay. It's something that everybody thinks about at that time. <laughs> 9 a.m. <laughs> oh, it's too early. Even though I'm not the best at running, she's making me want to go on a run. But not now at like 4.11 because, um, the sun's going down. <laughs> so maybe like mid-afternoon, 12, 11, 12, 1 maybe. 
Or on a walk. I haven't been on a walk in a, like, couple months. What's up? And the upbeat too. You always do everything with a smile too as well. Oh, M. <laughs> Consume me with that walk. <laughs> You just bring you she oozes of sunshine, smiles and mm. That's what I love about her. She also has like the best style. Her outfits like like so good. <laughs> Oh. 
Well, we do have, like, what, five girls left? Just makes you wonder who's next. Oh my god, Mina! Mina, baby, you're so short, cutie, bitty. I thought she wasn't the shortest! I thought it was you! <laughs> Isn't it cute, though? Oh my god, baby! Look at her! Oh! Oh, I just want to cuddle her and be like, you were just so fucking adorable. I love you so much. But yeah, I, it's just that ray of sunshine. I mean, you know, if you had a really bad day, I just come up and just be happy and just make your day feel so much better. So whoever has her as their number one best girl, I can see why she's your number one. At first, she was, like, immediately my number one. And I was like, yeah. I, like, the when I played the Japanese game, when I started up, the day it came out, I immediately chose her. But then I found out what her skill was, and I just re-rolled. And um, I think I chose uh, Best Girl Nozomi because Nozomi. But, yeah, I mean, she's just sweet and cute as a button and just passionate. Like, hella passionate. I mean... So much passion from this girl, cause like to the point where you can't really. <laughs> you, you look at anyone else, like her passion is just there. Like it's a big <laughs> glow of, of sunlight and everything that she loves so much. But she's just so sweet, and I love her so much. She she seems very similar to. I can't really think of any other girls from. Muse or Aqua, but if I want to say someone else, literally the band of Hello Happy World in a nutshell. And it works for her. No, it's gonna be Emma's turn. Aww. Um, Kitty! <laughs> yeah, it's definitely Emma's turn. Emma's one of them girls that, like, she's so down to earth. And you gotta love her. If you don't love Emma, like, what is wrong with you? I mean, she's just, she reminds me of, um, what the heck is her name? Uh, Aria from um, I Cut Two Stars and how, you know, if, if you've seen any picture of Aria from I Cut Two Stars and look at Emma, like, boom, right there. Like, they're, they're, they're very similar. Not, I wouldn't say they're like the same person, but the things that I've seen and Emma's aesthetic really just gives me those Aria feels every single time when I see her. No matter how many times if I rewatch her performance from my Katsu Stars or just like little cute moments of her in the series. But yeah, they literally both look similar. But yeah, Emma, I mean not Emma, um, I gives me a lot of Hello Happy World vibes. I mean, not only because it's positivity and upbeat and happiness and she is just this sunshine Kokoro, I mean, because really she is, she because she's so freaking upbeat and happy. Even though Hello Happy World is not my personal fave band, 
I, I get the fact of why people love it so much and why also, same thing with Emma, even though Emma, I mean not Emma, I is my second best girl. I can see why so many people were immediately drawn to her, including myself, until my actual best girl came in and was just like, no, it's me. Like, it ain't any of these girls. It's me. But <laughs> the fact that, you know, it's, I really thought we were going to get Rena next, but we're going Emma makes me wonder who's going to be after Emma. Maybe my best girl might be after Emma. Who knows? I don't know. I mean, we have five episodes left to focus on these next five girls. And I just, I, I want, I want an episode focused on my best girl. I need it. I just, so that I can finally go ahead and scout again for her to have possibly her other you are come. I, I mean, I don't think we're close to the other you are that I want. Um, necessarily i know we're on on for ian we just started the um the rainy day gotcha set that has that really pretty freaking nose of me that i want because like oh my god but i'm like no i'm like gotta save for my best girl for dj <laughs> as much as i love nose like because nose i mean it's like my number one and i loved her so much and i still do because i have a figure of her and it's in my closet even though i still need to buy a um a thing to hang out my fingers because that's what I really want for like the longest time because where I used to live it was like literally where my TV was but <laughs> yeah other than that guys that is my reaction view towards episode 4 of Love Live Nijigasaki School Idol Club if you guys enjoyed it please give me a like it really helps me out also subscribe to my channel I make videos every single day join the Master Squad and of course I will see you guys officially all next Saturday for episode 5 bye guys